Hello everyone, it's me Rolly Egg back with another video on the channel. Today's video is a tutorial of how to add the third rendering onto your Minecraft worlds on PS5. A crucial step is, is that you have to own realms, just so that way you can basically own the resource pack on your own world. And I advise having realms as if you to download the world with the resource pack on, it takes a very, very long time for it to actually download onto like your world. An example of this is this one here. I tried this one ages ago and it's like 1.1 gigabytes. And I just, I don't think you guys will, will want a world that takes up that much storage on like your world's list or preview. I know it's preview, but still. Okay, so when creating a world, what you need to do absolutely first thing is to make sure that the feature called Render Dragon Features for Creators is enabled. This is so the resource pack can actually work. And now, after that, I would advise as well, like, create it on Realms there and then if you already own it. Just because um, it can take, like, ages exporting one world. And I know it's a bit tedious, but, yeah. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to go to my world here and, re like, replace it with the Render Dragon features, like, turned on. And then replace the world on here with Realms. Then, obviously, once this is uploaded, which should be really quick, because I'm doing it there and then, which, obviously, it says here. So, if I press, I didn't press anything, but it just loaded me into the world now. Or the realm, should I say. But after it's loaded in, then just leave the world, and then I'll show you the next step. Okay, the first thing you want to do is search up MCPEDL and press on the website. On the website, search up Vanilla PBR and press the one where it says Vanilla Shaders. Then after that, go down to where it says Download and press the top one where it says 2.9 Release. Then it should take you to a tab where it says about downloading it, where it says press the Read Article button. Then go to the website there, don't touch anything at all because it's very dodgy. After about 10 to 15 seconds, go back on the other tab, then press Unlock Content. After that's done, it should take you to a media file uh, page where you can download the actual resource pack and then open it onto Minecraft Preview or Beta, then Edit or Realms, go down to Resource Packs and it should be there and ready for you to activate. Add the resource pack onto the world and then obviously let it upload onto Realms. This may take a minute, so I will cut ahead in the video. Okay, so now it's done. So, what you want to do now is go and play on the preview world. Once this is loaded up, I'll then show you the next step. And obviously, it may say unable to connect to world. So, and that's normal every time because it comes up with that every single time when I have a resource pack like this. So, don't panic. Just try it again. It'll work fine this second time. Okay, and now it's loaded up. Now, what you want to do is you want to... Obviously, as you can see, nothing has changed. It still looks like box standard regular Minecraft. Now, if I pause the game, go to my settings, go down to video, and go down onto the bottom here, which says graphics mode, I'm going to change that to the third technical preview. And if you exit, done. It's all beautiful looking. Like, look at me, look at the world. And you can, if you really wanted to, you can optimize your settings so your game doesn't lag so much. I have my settings on high, like on most of them. I might took down the chunks to like 8 though, just to make it run better. And look at that, it runs smoothly as like butter on toast. And yeah, so that is my tutorial of how you can add the third rendering onto your Minecraft world on PS5. I hope you guys found this tutorial useful. And I'm going to see you guys all later. Bye.